Alrighty, new day, new project. So I'm in my crawl space and uh, we have a lot of moisture down here. Even though I've done a lot of drains around the house, it is what it is. I have not encapsulated yet, but I had to take care of this. There's a lot of moisture down here. So went out and bought an April Air dehumidifier. Got the biggest unit they have, which is 1350 unit. Uh, I think it handles up to 3,500 square feet. Uh, we have a large crawl space and a lot of humidity down here. So uh, heavy unit, but wasn't too hard to install. Comes with uh, 110, eight foot, and we got also bought the little pump. Uh, me and my daughter installed it. My 13 year old helped me install it tonight. So not too difficult for us to do. Only I had to buy was some hose to connect. I bought the center blocks. I've got four of them. Level them off first. Then I put the plywood down here. It's a little bracket I've made. And another set for it to stand on so that way the pump sits down lower. I screwed it in and drain pipe running into it. Uh, other hose. Got a hose clamp. I had to buy two, or I had two hose clamps. I have to have those. And then I got this running into my drain system. Comes with 20 foot on the pump. I think that was like 80 bucks. And that one there, they vary on how much you pay for these. So it basically pulls the air in. It does have an air filter. It's washable. Uh, adjustments, hard to read the adjustments because I got pretty high up. But I think when I turned it on, it said humidity was at 76%. So that's pretty high. I set it to 50 because I figured I'd let it run. So you've been running about five minutes now. Uh, you can actually start to see, I don't know if you can see the water, starting to trickle out. My only concern is how far that, well, I mean the pump pumps, I ran it, it sprays it out. When it pumps, it kicks on. So you gotta make sure you have a hose clamp on there. And uh, so it's got about 10 feet to run to where it drains out. I'm not sure if it's gonna run up and then pour back down. I got a little low spot in it so it wouldn't back flush on me. And I'm gonna see how it runs here in a little bit. But anyway, uh, hope this helps because my ground, if you look at it, is just soaking. It's just wet down here. Uh, one of these days, maybe I'll put some plastic down, encapsulate it, but I've got a lot of other projects before that. I've got to get rid of this old uh, heating unit that's in the crawl space. Uh, got, that's got to be gone first and some other old equipment that's been down here for too long. So, But anyway, got it all installed. Took us about an hour, give or take, maybe, plus going to the hardware store once. So pretty straightforward nothing too complicated runs on 110 uh, you can get it wired or plugged in so make sure you order one that you get it plugged in or the one you hardwire in uh, it does make a difference so we're just gonna let it run here like I said it's just dripping out a little water a little steady stream coming out of there uh, after about 10 minutes now so it is doing its thing uh, 95 pints per day is what this will produce uh, but there you go that's what we got April air We'll see how she runs. It's got a five-year warranty. We'll take a look and see how it goes. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.